Germany signs. Kunde arrives and Timo Werner decision. Chelsea transfers after major sale. If everything goes to plan, Chelsea Football Club will have a new owner before the end of the season. Like we saw at Sanford Bridge almost two decades ago when Ken Bates sold the club to Roman Abramovich, a new era is set to begin. The supporters hope a suitable buyer is selected to move their club into a city future. They will quickly be thrust into the potential chaos of a summer transfer window. We had it confirmed by the Premier League on Thursday that this summer's window will open on 10 June and will close at 20 3 BST on 1 September in line with other European leagues. So without a knowledge of who will actually own Chelsea or what this predictably unpredictable club will face next, let's try and predict some of the big moves of his upcoming window. With the hope Chelsea's previous targets remain on the well wish list and all this madness hasn't accidentally put into the club shredder, the need for a new central midfielder has been clear for some time now. Both Angelo Conte and Giorgino are about to enter the final year of their current contracts. A decision will have to be made of for both, having to also address the need for a more defensive-minded midfielder Chelsea has lacked since 2017 when Emmanuel Matic left. The two clear targets here are Monaco Sorin Germany and West Ham's Declan Royce. Both have been on the club's radar for some time, but Germany might appear more realistic with West Ham's deep asking price for their English star. The top transfer priority should be a central midfielder and Germany's growth this season makes him a no-brainer. A deal that could have happened last summer felt an inevitability this year before the club's sanction and change of ownership. The French defender had been tracked by Chelsea for some time, and it appears the failure to secure his signature in 2021 has not halted the European Champions' pursuit. There are reports coming out of Spain that Sevilla has resigned to the reality that they will have to sell this summer and with Chelsea potentially losing both Antonio Riddick and Andres Christensen. The need for defensive reinforcements is clear.